the topic today is probability and the question you have reads a box contains red and green apples there are eight red and 28 green apples one apple is picked from the box at random without replacement then a second apple also picked at random then part a draw a tree diagram to represent the information up to when the second apple is picked and list all the possible outcomes b find the probability that the first apple picked is red then the second apple picked is green and then both the apples are of the same color and finally the apples picked are of different colors so we will begin with the first part uh, we draw a tree diagram to represent the information so the first thing we need to identify here is that we had one apple picked from the box at random without replacement without replacement simply means you pick and then the one that was picked is not replaced so the number reduces as you continue picking so we had the first picking and then a second apple also picked so the apples were picked twice from the box so this is represented as follows in the tree diagram so we have box a and from box a we have got the first picking so let's represent this with the first picking in the first picking we have to pick either a red or a green apple and then we are told that uh, there are eight red apples so that is eight out of a total of 8 plus 28 that gives us 36 fruits or rather apples and then if we opt to pick green apples or rather if you happen to pick green apples then the chance would be 28 out of 36 apples so these are the possibilities in the first picking now when you pick a second time so we make new branch so we have in the second picking so you can pick either a red or a green so this order here should fall a red green red green also here red and a green so if in the first option you had picked a red apple in the first picking then in the second picking the number of red apples should reduce by one because it was picking without replacement so the number of red apples would be seven and because the apple picked was not replaced so the total number should be 35 and then for the green apple the green apple was not touched so the number still remains 28 so we have 28 over 35 and then suppose uh, in the first picking a green apple was picked then in the second picking the number of green apples will reduce by one so we have 27 over 35 the total number of apples will also reduce because uh, it was a picking without replacement and remember when you pick a green that means a red was not touched so the reds are still eight eight out of a total of 35 so with this we can now form the sample space that is the list of all possible outcomes so in the first picking you can have a red followed by a red then a red apple in the first picking followed by oh sorry followed by a green apple in the second picking then we have 
the first picking a green apple followed by a red apple and finally a green apple followed by a green apple so this is the list of all the possible outcomes rr rg gr gg where r and g represents red and green apples respectively so with this tree diagram we can answer the following parts so find the probability that the first apple picked is red so where we have the first apple being red is here and here where in the first picking we had a red here also the first picking we have a red so we have the probability of having a red followed by a red for this first part here plus the probability of having a red followed by a green for this second part so far there are only two so we'll have for a red followed by a red by simply having 8 over 36 times 7 over 35 Then we'll have to add that to the second one, which is 8 over 36, then times 28 over 35. And working out this from a calculator, I get uh, that is 2 over 9. Then for the second part, we are told that find the probability that the second apple picked is green. So where do you have a green? So we have here and right there. So we're going to have the probability that it is a red followed by a green or probability that it is a green followed by a green. So those are the only two options where we have the second apple being a green apple so this would mean that we'll have for a red followed by a green that is a red followed by a green that is 8 over 36 times 28 over 35 8 over 36 times 28 over 35 plus probability of a green followed by a green that is 28 over 36 times 27 over 35 28 over 36 times 27 over 35 so when this is worked out from the calculator I get 7 over 9 then for Roman 3 both apples are of the same color so if both apples are of the same color that means you can have a red and a red or a green and a green so we have that as probability that the two apples picked are red and red or probability that the two apples picked are a green and a green so this will be given as red and red is 8 over 36 times 7 over 35 so 8 over 36 times 7 over 35 plus a green and a green is 28 over 36 times 27 over 35 for this line so that is 28 over 36 times 27 over 35 so working out this from the calculators uh, I'll be getting 29 over 45
And finally, find the probability that the apples picked are of different colors. So if they are of different colors, we are going to have a red and a green or a green and a red. So we have probability that it is a red and a green or probability that it is a green followed by a red. So this is simply having a red and a green from the tree diagram we have a red followed by a green that is 8 over 36 times 28 over 35 so we have 8 over 36 times 28 over 35 plus for the second part we are going to have Oh, sorry, so that is a green and a red. So a green followed by a red, that is 28 over 36 times 8 over 35. So we have 28 over 36 times 8 over 35. So when this is worked out, uh, we should be getting 16 all over 45. So that's it for this question. Thank you for your patience. Thank you for watching and see you next time.